Troy. And I'm Elise. And we're Dirt Road Dancing. Today we are going to learn about the slingshot. Alright, so for you leads, it's very important that we work on your counterbalance, and we'll talk about that in a second. And follows for us is all about that mirrored magnetism. Now, together, we really need to make sure that we're working on the energy and keeping that energy consistent with each other. So let's break down a little bit. Let's show it first, and then we'll break it down. All right. All right, so you can see there's a lot of different body positions, especially for the lead, that we've got to make sure we're counterbalancing properly. So for us, the start part of this point, as we're here, I'm going to step through and exchange spots, and my right hand's going to lead first, followed by my left hand, and then I'm going to counterbalance onto my left away from her. So you can see I'm actually in an offset position. Her energy is that way. I'm facing one that way, but I'm pulling back. Then when I bring her back through, we're gonna do a double spin and I'm gonna shift through here. On that last spin, I'm gonna turn, swing my left foot back and bring my energy still forward. So I'm counterbalancing forward as she's going back. That preps her for the slingshot. Then I'm gonna pull forward, let her whip around. The minute I catch, again, I'm going back on that counterbalance away from her so we can get into that stretch. Okay, so ladies, the way that we follow through it's about the hand cues and keeping our mirrored magnets into his. So our fingertips are down. Now as he brings us into the first part, I always want to mirror uh, my partner's tension. So think of your fingertips as magnets. You want to stay connected, but at the same time you want to mirror the grip that he's giving you. So in this case, we're going flat-handed. So I'm going to go flat-handed. He's bringing across. And then now he's kind of curling up a little bit, so that tells me I need to curl up just a little bit to mirror the tension. Now, as he brings me back through, we're gonna go flat again. I'm staying connected, mirroring that tension. Hands are magnets. At this point, he's showing me what I need to do, so I'm a little bit um, curled onto his fingers as well. Now, as soon as he slingshots me through, he completely disconnects, meaning I completely disconnect. He'll look to reconnect. So again, it's all about thinking of our fingertips as these mirrored magnets. Now together, we wanna to make sure that we're on the same energy level. I don't wanna give her too much that she flies away, and I wanna give her enough though that she knows the direction she needs to move. And ladies, that means that we're not adding in any more energy, nor are we blocking the energy that our lead is giving us. So as we come through, whatever tempo I set is where she's at, that counter. Come through, pull back. Now from here especially, there's a lot of tension right there. So I don't want to fly her out. I want to give her just enough to walk forward, start that rotation so I keep her where she needs to be and I can find her again real fast. Yes, yeah, so ladies, you're going to get the most energy with that free spin. You're going to free spin about one and a half times. So allow yourself to take that energy and use it all the way until you're settled in. Now at this point, we ended up in that open frame position. Gentlemen, your left hand catches with her right, and you go into one of a million other moves, look at one of our other tutorials, then you can go from here and keep dancing. All right, with that said, hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe to our page if you haven't already.